and to teach our children. You might possibly need for 10 schools, you might need 10 teachers. If at all, you have one class of mathematics in each of the schools. But with the advent of the fourth industrial revolution, it is possible to provide a gadgets to the children and only employ one teacher that is going to sit at a particular place and through both industrial revolution that teacher will be able to teach all those children in those 10 schools and therefore you might not need nine of the teachers now these are the challenges that we are experiencing in which we think we need to, to consider because as a training on recruitment we then get to be affected when it comes to the issues of recruitment. Basically, we are saying at the level of method, it is important for us to have regulations because as we move now, uh, there are no regulations that exist within the country in terms of making sure that there's protection of trade union in as far as <coughs> issues of recruitment are concerned and other rights that we have as trade union. But also, this is raising another aspect where in terms of the health and safety, you then find that by virtue of workers working from home, the, the responsibilities, the legislative responsibilities of the employers are therefore pushed away from the workers, away from the employers towards the direction of the um, employees or workers. <coughs> now, we are raising this because within the health and safety um, legislation, it is the responsibility of the employer, for instance, to ensure that the workplace um, is in such a manner that it is conducive for workers to operate there. But once they start working from home, all those responsibilities become the responsibilities of workers. And therefore, presenting a challenge to a point where even employers are not able or willing to compensate the workers. It is also important to consider that whilst we also have this mandatory vaccination, we know that as a position of the Federation, we agree that uh, workers should be encouraged to vaccinate. 